Hello, I'm Richard Ridge for Broadway World. The Share Show has come to Broadway. We're here at the Neil Simon Theater on opening night to talk to the stars, including Share herself. How excited are you two to be here tonight? I'm extraordinarily excited. We're thrilled. It's going to be um, an amazing night. The whole thing's going to be awesome. Do you have a favorite Share song? Uh, you believe in life after love. I yeah, think it probably sure. takes that's the cake. The that's the one. Yeah, that's the one. Well, look, I was a huge Share fan. I am mm -hmm. totally a Share fan. Uh -huh. Are you a Share fan? <laughs> Yes, yes, I, absolutely. I don't, I don't know anybody who's not a Cher fan. Right? She has a big following. <laughs> when were you first aware? Was it the Sunny and Cher show? Sunny and Cher show, yeah, yeah. absolutely, yeah. That was, you know, she has been a part of American culture in various forms for, for decades. It's amazing. When were you first aware of Cher? I don't remember not being aware yeah. of Cher. Yeah. She's just sort of uh, been a part of my uh, creative space yeah. since before I can remember. It's like a warrior goddess. She's always reinvented herself. Reinvented herself, yep. fearless with her art, with her words, with her fashion, and with yep. her heart. Were you always a Cher fan? You know, I, I gotta be honest, of course I knew who Cher yeah. was, and I, yes, I loved listening to her songs on sure. the radio. She wasn't the one person I was yeah. like, I wanna be like Cher when I grow up. You wanna be Julie Andrews. Yes, I did, personally. Yeah. But like, everyone knows who Cher is. Sure. Everyone does, and I'm thrilled that there's a musical now to share her story, Cher, sure. all these Cher, all these no, like, That's what it's about, yeah. To share her story. Um, and I think the truths behind her life that people probably don't really know about. Yeah. And I have a lot of friends in the cast, and I, I couldn't be more excited. I was just saying to someone that Cher has basically been doing what she's been doing at the top of the game my entire life and beyond, and I'm so excited to bring her story to the stage. When were you first aware of her? I'm ready. I can't even think of a time when I was not aware of her, actually. I mean, I like as deep back in my mind, there have been uh, Cher influences on my life. I just love how you how you built the sets with the seas that it looks like a television studio but it is a personal side to the whole thing i mean what were you thinking when you were designing this well we kept thinking about a kaleidoscope yeah. you know shares life shares images are kaleidoscopic yeah. and so we looked at mirrors and all the images of her throughout the years and just tried to pull it all together yeah i haven't seen an audience like this in a long time and people are just screaming at the stage and and stephanie block uh, um, and, and the whole cast, but you know, Stephanie leading this cast is um, you're you're seeing the true definition of a star, and it's um, it's something to see. Favorite share song? Do you have one? Uh, well, besides I, the whole canon, the the whole canon. Um, gosh, I like so many of them, but you know, she does a mean cover of "Walking in Memphis." I saw it last week, and I yep. loved it. Stephanie Block is amazing. She should get every award. Just the walk. Yep. She does the share walk like nobody's business. I just love the show, and I'm thrilled to be here again. Kim and Kanye are here. Cher is here. I'm here as Rosie's date. I'm here plus one. How excited are you to be here? It's the share. Well, I just show. let my hair down. I'm sorry. I excited. love it. I know I'm doing the share. I'm doing like the jumpsuit, yeah. the whole thing. I'm just so excited to be here. And it's just such an honor. And I'm so happy she's on Broadway. And, and she's here. Everybody. And she's she's literally yeah, here. Sure. But just to hear the music and to see her, I want. Hope I can see her reaction to everything. I'm very excited. I never got to see Cher perform live, so this is going to be my moment, because I never had that experience growing up. So. You're going to see three Shares, yeah. and you're going to see the real Cher inside. That's what I heard, oh, that yeah. she's her, here. Oh, yeah. It seemed like a crazy event that yeah. was happening over We're here. Yeah, we're very excited. We can see from our dressing rooms, sometimes I can see Michaela and Teal yeah. like, getting yeah. ready, and I'm just like, whoa, I thought our costumes yeah. were a lot. These costumes are... Yeah. Unreal. <laughs> I mean, I knew her when she was, I didn't know her, but you know what I mean, like aware of her because we were older when she was a pop star with Sunny, and that was a big deal in the yeah. late 60s. Yeah. But that variety show was hard to beat. Yeah. Totally. It really was. Just someone who has a, a, an authentic likability about them and a specificity to who they are that she's been able to right. communicate that with people for sure. decades. Okay, so I saw the show last week. I know you went already to see it. I did, yeah. Now, I did. Let's talk about that Bob Mackie fashion show. How oh, incredible well, is it. that? It's all about Bob. You yeah. know, the, those those costumes are just, just so the epitome of what he does so expertly as far as fit is concerned, as far as glamour is concerned, glitter, lots of wonderful exciting they're all exciting you know they're not not only beautiful but it's just exciting every favorite number it's every favorite bob mackie oh i'm the, so yeah. excited the bob back the bob mackie clothes i mean i cannot 
Wait, I cannot believe Bob Mackie designed all the clothes. It's going to be a stellar evening. I cannot wait. There's a Bob Mackie fashion show in uh, this. I'm I'm dying with anticipation. And of course, to yeah. see like these three incredible actresses play Cher, too, yeah. I think that's going to be a real treat, too. You've not seen the show yet, have you? No. All right, wait till you see the Bob Mackie fashion show that goes by in this show. I can't wait. I just can't wait. I know. No. He never made me an Indian outfit, but... Well, he's made you a lot of outfits. A lot. A lot of beautiful dresses. What is it like wearing Bob Mackey? Oh, you feel so good. You feel like like everything is where it belongs, where it should be, yeah. and you know it's going to stay there yeah. <laughs> throughout the night. Just to watch her life fly by and to watch your clothes, just tell me what it means to you doing this for Broadway. Well, it just I, it's just something that... I, you know, they, in the beginning, they really weren't going to have me do the costumes, and I and I just said, you know, I think I should be doing this, yeah. and uh, and she thought so too. So I'm doing it. I hope you like it. Jared Spector is a dear friend. He was my Barry in Beautiful, and I am I am like beside myself with joy to see him yeah. just like bring down the house along with these incredible oh, women. Sure. Yeah. Oh, wait until you see him as Sunny. I, You're going to be like, is that my friend? I literally have seen photos, and just the wig alone, I'm like, he's transformed. Oh, He's transformed. He becomes Sunny. I am. I am so excited. I'm beaming. Watching Jared in this role has been one of the most exciting things I've ever done. Yeah. So yeah, I'm a little fangirl tonight. Okay, because I saw it the other night. He walks on to the most amazing round of applause, and then he opens his mouth and starts to talk and sing. And you're looking at Sunny Bono. You're looking at Sunny Bono. I don't recognize him. Sometimes I forget that's my husband, and I'm well, genuinely a fan of whoever that is. Telling somebody before that Cher has had one of the longest and most prosperous careers of any musician, and for me as a young musician, it's like one of the most ideal things to look up to is somebody that has just killed it for such a long amount of time, and. Uh, I could only, could only uh, always be inspired by something like that. Favorite share song? Do you have one? Yeah, I, ju I just said to somebody, I have 20, okay. but um, the one that always comes to mind is Dark Lady for the older, you know, oh, yeah. batch. You could do a mean version of Dark Lady, right? Oh, yeah. yeah, I could. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. I think tonight's just going to be so much fun. As every song hits us and hits our ears, everybody's just going to be taken into the nostalgia of what it meant to them at that, at that time. But... Of course, I'm always good with my 80s share. If I could turn back time, that was, you know, that was always good stuff. There's always been a mystery about share. Yeah. I think that, that that's something that has really, really uh, drawn people to yeah. her all these years. Do you have a favorite share song? I, I have so many. Oh um, my gosh, I mean, uh, uh, well, I was singing, If I could turn back time, babe, I got you, babe. Do you believe in life after love? Talk about these three beautiful women who play your life on stage. What that's like for you? Well, first of all, and I say this, but I couldn't have, this cast is so amazing, and those girls are frightening. You know, they're just, they're just so me. Yeah. You know, did you see it? Oh, I saw it two oh. nights ago. I love this. Okay, no, yeah. I mean, they're very me, and and I, I talk to all of them about, like, I tell them stories yeah. about what happened, and, you know, so I try to give each one of them some stories that make them know her more. You fucked her every time. You fucked to me.